Hello guys, MMAT Talk back at it again with another video. And this time, we got ourselves a real tea. It is a good day today. You rarely see somebody spilling tea in MMA community. But when you see it, come to my channel. Because I'm gonna talk about it. So we have Megan Anderson, a former UFC fighter. She's now working at ESPN. And she is spilling all the tea. She came after her coach, James Cross. And James has been in hot waters because of the whole betting thing in MMA. There has been heavy accusations of him betting on his fighter or on his fighter's opponents. Because, you know, he knows all about the injuries and how you are training in camp so he can bet against you and so forth so on and he himself has said that he's making a lot more money betting than fighting in UFC or training athletes he has made some crazy money via betting and now we have Megan Anderson saying that he's a trash ass coach this whole thing started when someone commented on Megan Anderson's YouTube video. Shout out to that guy. His account name is Satch Brown. Shout out to him. Without him, we will not have any of this tea. So he wrote that Megan Anderson threw her coaches under the bus. She blamed her loss to Amanda Nunes on Glory MMA. Meanwhile, Brando Moreno is thriving at Glory. And Megan Anderson responded that she only received one 30 minute bad session a week for entire seven months she said that she received no individual coaching throughout the sparring rounds and throughout her training no matter how many times she asked to sit down and talk about the game plan excuses were always given to her for it to never happen and she's saying that that is not throwing them under the bus this is exactly what happened so she's accusing James Cross of completely ignoring her and only focusing on Brando Moreno. She continued that Brando Moreno had personalized sessions every single day. Whenever he traveled for the UFC Spanish podcast, the coach traveled with him to make sure that he had personalized training at all times. Damn. James Cross said that, hey, Fuck all these fighters that is gonna lose. I'm not gonna pay any attention to them. I'm gonna only focus on the winners. Maybe he knew that Miguel Anderson is gonna completely get destroyed by Amanda Nunes. So why waste his time on her when he can spend time with Brando Moreno? But of course this is only coming for Miguel Anderson. We haven't heard other fighters come out against James. But you know, as they say... When there's smoke, there's fire. Now, let's move on on the Laura Senko part. So, Doug Phillips on Twitter tweeted to Megan Anderson, I quote, Imagine going to Glory MMA of all places for proper coaching and then somehow sleeping with James Cross. Lord have mercy. Then Megan Anderson responded, You should look at Laura Senko about that actually. She threw Laura Senko under the bus. If you guys don't know, Megan Anderson and Laura Senko were best friends. They were making YouTube videos together. So Megan Anderson knows what Laura Senko is doing at the Glory MMA. She has all the dirty secrets. By the way, the name Glory MMA is a great fit for that gym. James Cross is fucking these hoes. Or let's not go that far okay i'm not uh andrew tate okay <laughs> let's let's dial it back james cross is sleeping with the fighters james cross is married i think so lara senko is married with the kids and megan anderson just destroyed their marriage this is crazy is this what you do to your friend Come on, this is a dirty, dirty move by Megan Anderson. We will see what Laura Seng is gonna respond. They both work on ESPN. This is gonna be real spicy. Real, real spicy. 
And James Cross hasn't said anything about this. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Anyway, let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about this. Was this a dirty move by Megan Anderson exposing Laura Senko for no reason? She destroyed her marriage. Or maybe Laura Senko has this open relationship. You know, maybe the husband is okay, Laura Senko sleeping with other men. We don't know, but we will see what's gonna happen. I will keep you guys informed. And if anybody that is on Glory MMA, send me DM on Instagram because I wanna know all the tea that is happening in Glory MMA. Is James Cross fucking all the girls there? What's going on? Is he a good coach or is he a dirty coach? Is he betting on the fighters making a ton of money? Sleeping with all the females there. Send me DMs. I will not say your names unless you want me to say your name. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel. Like this video if you like. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Goodbye.